Today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. We're going to check the efficiency of the Pacifica Hybrid plug-in. So we're going to see how many miles we can get on electric. We're going to see if we can get, it's really rated for 32 miles all electric. Let's see if we can get close to 32 miles. I'm thinking probably we can driving very cautiously. So let's see how it goes. And with the Pacifica Hybrid, it does actually not see stop signs. I actually have to stop at them myself. It's kind of disappointing actually. We're gonna take all side streets to see how efficient we can be. So this is not really a real world. How many miles can you get on electric only in a Pacific Hybrid? This is more like best case scenario. What can you get all electric in a Pacific Hybrid? Right at 10 miles now. Car still says 23 miles remaining. Although we are going quite slow, probably about 30 miles per hour ish based on uh, 22 minutes almost and only 10.2 miles so definitely going on the slow side uh, but that was the plan see if we could get uh, over 32 miles all electric and looks like we're pretty close uh, to being able to do that if we continue at this pace still says 76 percent left so in theory we should get over 40 miles but I think that's definitely optimistic. All right, so I actually missed uh, 50%. Got down to 49%. It's actually maybe hard to see that. 48% now at 18.9 miles. Still going really slow on average. Uh, but Looks like we're no longer on pace to get 40 miles out of this charge. Surprise, surprise. So we'll see how it goes. It uh, still seems like we're gonna get over 30, no problem. But now the percentage is going down, down, down. I think it's because we're going uphill. So we'll see if it gets better. As it turns out, getting close to the destination, uh, so I'm not going to be able to test the full 30 miles, but we still do have 12% left, so probably about 10% at 28 miles, maybe 29 miles. So I definitely think we're gonna be able to get over 30 miles. However, uh, I am picking up something that's gonna make it uh, quite a disadvantage for the trip back so not a very good test needless to say i do think it is quite impossible to get 40 miles on a charge but it is only rated for 32 so 32 would be what i would hope to get and we'll see maybe I still will get 32 miles after we um, get the payload for the trip home all right, starting the trip off home. Seven nine percent, three miles. It says we'll get on that, and a little extra luggage to deal with. So that could definitely impact the efficiency. But I think we'll still get over thirty miles, all electric. Thirty-two would be perfect. So we'll see. There we are, 30 miles. Definitely got the 30 miles. 5% left. I don't think we're gonna get the 32 miles. Questionable. Ladder's still there, so that's a good sign. All right, down to 2%, 31.2 miles. Just gonna switch over to gas any minute here. 
31.4 miles. Uh, I think we're gonna make it because we're going downhill. Downhill will get us 32 miles all electric. Come on. It says zero miles, 1%. 31.9. Thirty-two. All right, so we did it. Thirty-two miles, all electric, in the Pacific Hybrid, and overall, I would say it's achievable on the side streets if you're going slow and careful, um, and are not uh, carrying anything like other people and 40 foot ladder, 33.6. And we got another stop sign. So it looks like we might get 34 miles. That's kind of crazy. I think it's gonna switch over here any second now. Come on, 34 miles, wow. Better than expected. There it goes. Gasoline kicked in right at 34 miles. So that's really good. It's rated at 32. If you take it easy on the side streets, you can definitely get 32. And that's even with 50,000 miles on the battery, so it's definitely not fresh. Uh, as far as the battery goes, it's got, uh, I mean, you know, 50,000 miles of use. It is a hybrid normally, so. When it's using it in hybrid mode, I don't know, it, it's probably keeping it in a nice range for the battery, kind of using it to gain some electricity down the hill and then use it a little bit uh, other times. So it's good to have that regenerative braking and it, it does use the battery a lot, but 50,000 miles, it's using that up and down. So 34 miles at, as, out of a rated 32 is definitely good um, a lot better than we did last time when we weren't trying to do it so when we had the bikes and we were going on the interstate and that sort of thing you're not going to get 32 miles on a charge but uh, I think we got 26 which is considerably less but hey it's still good so thanks for watching this is a little different uh, Please give me a thumbs up if you like this content and want more like it, and subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one.